We're taking a closer look tonight at the budget proposal revealed during Governor Lincoln Chafee's State of the State Address. You saw the speech, uh, speech live last night right here on WPRI 12 and on WPRI.com. We learned that if the governor gets his way, voters will be asked to sign off on the largest bond referendum in Rhode Island history, a loan to beef up the School of Engineering at URI. Today, Chafee was a guest on Newsmakers with Target 12 investigator Tim White. Tim joins us now with the details you need to know about the governor's plan. Before those questions even appear on the November ballot for you to consider, the General Assembly has to give them the green light, and that's no sure thing. In Governor Lincoln Chafee's $8.5 billion budget proposal, he wants voters to approve a lot of borrowing. The big uh, item there, as you mentioned, is the URI Engineering School, $125 million. So that's the big one. In all, the bonds would total $275 million, $125 million for URI, $75 million for environmental projects, $40 million for transit hubs like Providence's Kennedy Plaza, and $35 million for arts and culture organizations like Trinity Rep. Remember, a budget is a global document. House Speaker Gordon Fox pointed to those requests as his biggest concerns. Um, I think that the borrowing and, and what the numbers really, you know, the budget is always about the devils in the details. And, and to see they're all good needs and they're all competing needs, but again, looking at what we can afford and what are the outlying out budget deficits caused by the borrowing is going to be something that both our committees look at. Uh, so I had some reservation about such a big number and it's the, really the investment they wanted was even more than that uh, for this engineering school and renovations to existing buildings to do with the engineering school. But Chafee says private corporations reached out to his office saying the upgrades were needed to help grow jobs. And other companies were calling and saying please put that on the ballot and we'll come up with some private money to help also. Uh, so I'm now uh, enthusiastically supportive. One thing to keep in mind, interest rates are very low right now, making it a favorable financial climate to borrow. The House Finance Committee will start looking at the entire budget proposal later this month. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News. You can see our entire interview with Governor Lincoln Chafee right now on WPRI.com and on Newsmakers this weekend, Sunday at 5.30 a.m. here on WPRI 12 and 10 a.m. on Fox Providence.